Sue Grafton presents... A Joy Cake, The Conqueror. Oh. Made as part of a plea bargain with the Inglewood Police Department. Flatulent movie. Have you ever noticed that people walk in the streets like the alphabet? No, no, I haven't. They do, you know. Not really. And that goes for grown-ups and children alike. None will be spared. I'm sure you know one of the alphabet walkers, the most common one, the J walker. Dynamite! He crosses the street anywhere he likes. In the middle of the block, he just walks into the trap. Geez, no children were endangered in the making the of this film, right? The says that a jaywalker is someone who crosses the street carelessly without obeying the traffic regulations. <sighs> like an idiot. So that he is endangered by the traffic. And you know what a jay is? Or a silent Well, bomb. besides being a bird, it also means a silly person. Right, stop that, silly. And that is just what the jitterbrain jaywalker is. Don't be a jayhole. Don't jaywalk. When you have to cross the street, always use a marked crosswalk or go to a street corner. Best of all, one with a traffic signal. It's the children of the darned. Then wait until the light changes to green and carefully cross the street with the green light, always watching for cars that may be turning into your street. If you remember the rules and regulations of walking correctly in the street, and if you obey them at all times, you'll get an A in walking wisely. And Jesus will love you more. So don't be a jaywalker, be an A walker. With severe rickets. But the jaywalker isn't the only kind of pedestrian who doesn't know how to walk in the street. Here comes Martin Lawrence. Have you ever seen the jaywalker? He is always gawking at something. Gee, he says, look at that, and that, and that. Gee. This speaks to a deeper Goggle problem, I think. Goggle-eyed, the jaywalker gazes at all sorts of things, and he doesn't look where he's going. Too busy gawking at other things, the only thing he isn't looking at is the traffic. The only things he doesn't observe are the traffic rules. Always watch where you're going. Also, don't be, be an idiot. And careful when you walk in the streets. You don't want to be a goggle-eyed G-walker. Like the Johnson boy. Mickey and Mallory, the early be years. A walker. Like Bill and Betty. Besides being A walkers, they're also C walkers. Confused yet? See? How they walk in a street that has no sidewalk? They walk all the way at the edge of the road in single file and on the left side against the traffic so that they can see the cars coming and the cars can see them. When they flip the bird. Bill and Betty are real sea walkers for they can see all the traffic all the time and get out of the way if they have to. Always remember to walk against the traffic if you have to walk on a road that has no sidewalk. Yeah, you just said so that. that. you can see the cars coming. And there are lots of other alphabet walkers floating about in the streets. I'm sure. Like letters and a bowl of alphabet soup or, or cereal. Or like a weak analogy. This boy is an eye walker. Eye walker, eye Texas that Ranger. as long as he crosses the street at a street corner, he need only think of himself. Here I come, says the eye walker. I am going to cross the street. And he steps off the curb right in front of the traffic. Let's hate him together. The eyewalker is inconsiderate, and he takes a big and dangerous risk. For one day, the car may not be able to stop in time. It may be John Corzine's Always car. Always look carefully both to the left and to the right and to the left again, even though you do cross the street at an intersection as you should. Show consideration for the drivers and be safe yourself. Give the drivers back rubs and freshen their drinks. Don't ever behave like the ill-mannered eye walker. Or you will surely die. And the inconsiderate eye walker has a cousin, the K walker. Let's stretch this crappy premise even thinner. You remember the legend of King Arthur and his Knights of the Round Table? Well, they have nothing to do with traffic. There was the gallant Sir Lancelot and the courteous and considerate Sir Galahad. But there was also a knight who was nothing but a boastful show-off Sir Kay. Oh, foul, come on. And Jim Henson's just Gary Busey Walker babies. Is too. A conceited, cocksure clown. The street is no place for the carnival capers of the K Walker. 
if you want to do tricks or play games, there are lots of places where it's much more fun to do them. Like church or a jewelry store. The Englewood Elementary Redemption. Sometimes the K-Walker jumps about like a kangaroo, throwing caution to the winds, trying to show off. It's only luck that he doesn't get hurt. And that's now he's why Val Kilmer. smart boys and girls don't clown in the street and behave like the cocksure K-Walker. In his clan hat. Or like the open-mouthed O-Walker. Oh, how many more letters in the alphabet anyway? The O-Walker hasn't learned how to obey the rules for walking wisely and correctly in the streets, and sometimes he'll act like a real oaf. David Letterman, oh. no! One of the worst things anyone can do is run out into the street from between parked cars. It supports terrorism. The old walker doesn't think before he acts. Oh, says the old walker, I forgot. And there he is, the open-mouthed old walker, ready to be bowled over. These kids but are it omnipresent. It really isn't hard to remember that you should stay on the sidewalk, except when you have to cross the street. And we know now how that is done, don't we? Next up is the Epsilon Walker. Down towards the end of the alphabet, we find another wild letter walker. I'm sure you all know him. The Y Walker. Hey, back at you, buddy. The Y Walker performs semaphore in the middle of the road. He's a real wiseacre. Why, says the Y Walker. Why walk when you can hitch a ride? Why, indeed. Why, you don't know anything about the motorist who might pick you up. You don't know what kind of a person he might be. Maybe he Warren could be Beatty. a very bad driver, for instance, and you could have a serious accident. Hitchhiking can be dangerous, so don't hitch rides with strangers. Unless, On you know, you want to. On school, always walk the same safe route. The one your parents know and have told you to take. The one through the I'm Amber sure Alert Zone. you don't zone. want to wind up in trouble. So don't be a wiseacre Y-walker. Sit on it, pal. God, no, we're back at the beginning. You see, in order to walk safely and wisely in the streets, you'll have to mind your P's and Q's. Policemen and quiz masters? All those alphabet walkers still have to learn how to walk wisely. If only there were a convoluted educational film on the subject. Like Bill and Betty. Hmm. And you can learn from them. Me? Be a letter-perfect pedestrian. Don't be a jaywalker. No. Be an A-walker. Brought to you by the Council for Unhelpful Abbreviations and Analogies.